I'm Corwin. I'm playing Crick. Uh, it's a pretty linear mono black deck that aims to do Mike and Trike for infinite damage or Ether Flux to storm off. I'm Marco. I'm playing Shabraz and Brawlin. This deck focuses on Shabraz, drawing a lot of cards, and making a big shark. Hi, I'm Mab, and I'm playing Balthor. I'm going to reanimate some shit. Hi, I'm Ken. I'm playing Joda. It's a modular deck, and this pile is based on time. Time, time, time is on my side. Mana Crypt, tap it for Lightning Greaves, and play a Snow-Covered Swamp, tap it to Vampiric Tutor. Woo! Uh, so nice. I will go to 38, tutor a card at the top of my library, and pass. I'm going to play a land and cast myself a Shadow Spear and pass. I'll play a Swamp, and I'm not going to do anything as exciting, because I'm going to pass. Play a Verdant Catacomb. Catacombs. I'll play a Verdant Catacombs. I'll crack it for a Taiga and cast a Sylvan Safekeeper and pass the turn. During my upkeep, I will roll for Mana Crypt. Evens hurt. That's a three. Boo. Play Ancient Tomb. I'll tap the Mana Crypt to play a Mind Stone. I will tap the Ancient Tomb, the Snow-Covered Swamp, and the Mind Stone, taking two damage to play a 2-2 Walking Ballista. I would also like to equip the Lightning Greaves to it, and I will pass. I will untap, draw for turn, play a Plains Return, and I'm going to cast Swiftfoot Boots, and I'll pass. At your end step, I'm going to tap one, and I'm going to Entomb. Crick in my graveyard. It's a good one. I think so. Untap, draw, play a land per turn, tap two, animate dead. Nice. I got a Crick before the Crick deck. I'm going to pay two life and play a uh, Stitcher Supplier. I'll mill three cards. Hey, a Stinkweed Imp and two Swamps. I'm on tap. I'll draw. Play a Scrubland. Tap two. Play a Bloom Tender. I will roll for a Mana Crypt. Uh, evens hurt. That's a two, so I'll take three. I will play a Snow Covered Swamp. I will tap the Mind Stone for one, the Mana Crypt for two, and two Snow Covered Swamps. And pay four life to cast Crick. Going to 29. Marco, do you have any creatures? I don't. Well, you're the only one at 40 still, so let's attack you for two. I'll go down to 38. And I will pass. I'll play an island. I'm going to play an elixir of immortality. I will pass the turn. No, I will not draw. We'll dredge five. Viscerous Seer, Veto, two swamps, and a Neitherborn altar. Play a swamp. Mm. I'm going to tap three, pay six life, and cast a DC. I will sack Stitcher Supplier. That'll mill me three. That got me a return centaur and two swamps. And I'm going to go tutor a card. And this will not be the end of my turn. What about like a uh, destroy target crick card? <laughs> I'm looking, I'm looking. <laughs> Oh, and my crick goes up a size. Corwin, you got a uh, Micaeus the Unhallowed in that hand over there? I do not, and it's just the one card. I'm kind of out of gas, unfortunately. I think what I'll do is probably just try to race towards death. I'm going to grab that card, and sadly, I am going to actually pass my turn. I'll play a Tarnished Citadel as my land for turn. Mab, how many cards do you have in hand? I think four. Okay... Uh, I just can't. I can't afford to give Corwin gas right now with that board. It's just too. It's just too strong. Tap this Tarnished Citadel for blue, and tap the Bloom Tender for green. Cast Joda. It occurs to me I paid too much life. I'm gonna make my life total correct. I paid six when I was only supposed to pay four. Then I will pass the turn. Sweet. I really misplayed by not tapping the Ancient Tomb and paying four instead of paying two. I wasn't thinking. I will untap. We'll roll for Mana Crypt, uh, evens hurt, that's a three, so we're all good. I will draw a card. I will tap a Snow Covered Swamp, the Mind Stone, and the Mana Crypt to cast Greed. <laughs> yeah. <Ooh>. Nice. <laughs> Race towards death faster than me. Yeah. Yeah, let's get it. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll see. So I'll tap a Snow Covered Swamp and pay two life, going to 27 to draw a card. I will play a Swamp. I will tap it and pay another two to draw a card. Uh, oh, my bad. 
Crick got a counter when I played Greed. I will just pass. Play it. I'm gonna cast a smothering <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, that's nice. Well, hopefully. I'll pass. I'll untap. I'll draw. May I make a treasure? You may. Now I have to make a choice. And that choice is clear. I'm gonna pay three mana and six life and cast Bolus' Citadel. <laughs> yeah, I knew that's what you tutored for when you said I'm gonna charge towards death. <laughs> oh man. I'm at 28. The Bolus' Citadel happens. I'm gonna pay two life and put a Blood Artist into play. Oh boy. I'm just gonna keep track of the life and then update my screen when I'm done. Uh, pay five life, so that's seven total so far, for a Dictate of Erebos. Mm. I'm gonna pay another five life, that's 12, for a final parting. A double tutor, one to graveyard, one to hand. Let's put Grey Merchant in the graveyard, that card in hand. Go up to 15 and get Ayara. Each of you will lose a life and I'll gain a life. Okay. I'll, I'll just take this down to 14. <laughs> mm -hmm. Life lost. I'm going to play my land per turn and then take a look. I'm going to pay three life, get this to 17, and have a Pawn of Ulamog enter. I'm going to Mausoleum Secrets for another two life, going to 19 life loss so far. Count is one, two, three, four, five. So a CMC five or less into my hand. Oh shoot, uh, Crick has gotten one, two, three, four, five counter, six, seven counters. It's gonna be Chainer. Yes, okay, yep. Now look, and it's a land, so that stopped. <laughs> okay, whew. I'm gonna pay two more life, go to 21 life loss. Does that mean you're at seven um, or? Means I'm at seven. I'll cast uh, Putrid Imp. Seems like a mono black deck to me. Uh, and I'll gain a life off of that, and you'll all lose a life. I will discard Chainer. I will discard Gruesome Scourger. I will discard Stinkweed Imp. I'm going to tap one and pay two more life to go to 22 life loss. So I am at six, and I'm going to cast Dance of the Dead, targeting Chainer. All right, y'all lose a life, I gain a life. So that's 21 life loss. I can do that. I'll be at one. I'm going to pay six life and go to one. <laughs> and I'm going to reanimate Grey Merchant. Yeah, how much is it draining us for? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. Nice. And then you <sighs> can reanimate Viscerous here, correct? Now that I have that hey, life, I can re wait. reanimate Viscerous. Responses to Gary. You're at one when you cast Gary because you paid for it, right? Shoot you with yeah. walking ballista. <laughs> wow in response in response wow I'm yeah. gonna tap Bullis the Citadel sack all the permanents one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and I will sack all of these permanents the blood artist Okay, in response to you activating Bolus' Citadel, I will shoot you again with walking bullets. Yeah. Wow. Damn. I should have been more patient. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Wow. But I was going to race towards death. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> walking Ballista. Oh, my God. Well, thank you, Corwin. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Uh, that was, yeah. that was a very... That was a very mono black charge towards death, and we live to fight another day, courtesy of that little two two walking blista. Wow, bless very, up! Very, very good thought. Oh, okay, I'm gonna untap. Can't blame me for trying. No, that was that was, that was, that was beautiful. That was very very close. I'm gonna draw a card. I'm gonna play a bad lands is my land for turn. I'm gonna tap Bloom Tinder for everything but black, and tap the bad lands for black. And I'm going to cast Omniscience. Oh shit! Out of the <laughs> out of the frying pan and into the fire. <laughs> Marco's dog agrees. All good on the Omniscience? Well, I mean, yes. Oh, and Marco, I did not I did not pay for a treasure. Ah, a treasure. Yeah. So I will next cast Emergent Ultimatum. Yep. Sounds like game. I figure I should try to do something. I, I think he's probably got us. So I will pay two life. 
I will, with Crick's ability, cast a uh, Reign of Filth. Nice. Sack one for a black and pay two life to draw a card. We'll go to 18. I should have attacked with Crick. And I will draw a card. Sack another land, activate greed, and pay another two, going to 16. Two draw a card. Pay four life, two from Crick's ability and two from greed, going to 12 to draw another card god um you know you want to sack that last swamp you know you want to (laughs) i'll pay four more from crick and greed going to eight to draw another card oh uh marco all these are triggering smothering tithe oh my goodness uh how many so far like three i have drawn four cards wow that really didn't didn't do it uh (laughs) i will sack this swamp and pay two to draw another card, going to six. Oh, no instance. I think that's it. I will pass priority. <laughs> Marco, anything on emergent ultimatum? I don't have any responses. Okay, I'm gonna search three monocolored cards. Got too greedy. What, in a mono black deck? A mono black stormish deck? No, no such thing as too greedy. Marco, I'm gonna present you this choice. Mm-hmm. How did I know I was getting the choice? Time stretch? expropriate and peer into the abyss you may re you may shuffle expropriate i will shuffle in expropriate and cast peer into the abyss and time stretch Mm -hmm. i will put time stretch on top of peer into the abyss okay so i'll take two extra turns and i will draw half my library and lose half my life i would have not let you have the peer into the abyss with omniscience out because it's all that card draw Oh, Omniscience is out. Oh, that was a misplay. Yeah, I forgot about... Well, at least it'll be over sooner. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Will will it, though, or will he just take uh, 30 turns and not do jack shit with it? No, I think half of the deck is going to lead to a faster win. So I'm going to draw 42 cards, and I'm going to lose 17 life. So go to 16. All right, I've got the cards drawn. I've got two extra turns. Oh, Let's... how many cards did you draw? Oh, man. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. 40, 44 cards. And you're not going to pay for any of those? Nope, absolutely not. Okay. <laughs> Please make all of the treasures in the whole wide world. I will cast Swarm Intelligence. I'll cast Demonic Tutor. Trigger Swarm Intelligence and Demonic Tutor twice. Getting Second Son and... Another tutor card? You know me so well. Uh, I'm just going to show you Approach of the Second Sun and a double vision. I guess in response, I'll tap the Ancient Tomb and float. Uh, I will sack it for a black. I will pay two and draw a card with greed, going to four. I don't think I can do it. I think you got it. (laughs) Cast Approach, put it seventh from bottom. From top. Seventh from the top. I'll cast one extra turn spell, two extra turn spells. Not this one, because it shuffles my library. Three, four, five. Uh, So that would be ten extra turn spells, so I'll be able to draw it. (laughs) Nice. You should have just let me win. 